on guys joe with mgrc.com so uh we got the kyosho 2021 toyota tundra so yeah we're gonna go ahead and run this on just bone stock showing it off to you guys seeing how fast it goes and then we're gonna go ahead and upgrade it to a brushless system running on 2s and then also on 3s that brushless system is just a an easy run it's just a 60 amp with a 4000 kv brushless motor from hobby wing so we'll go ahead and uh, test this out for you guys. So let's get we'll going. Zeroed out on our GPS on miles per hour. So let's go ahead and see how fast it goes. Bone stock. As expected, 25 miles an hour. So we're gonna go ahead and just run it around just a little bit, get some other little shots of it, and then go ahead and upgrade this and show you guys the upgrade process. All right, first run, dirty, after doing some donuts. So we're gonna clean it up here a bit and then do the upgrade. We have all our gear here to do the little upgrade. So we have the aluminum drive shaft here. We have our easy run as far as our 4,000 kV brushless motor, our 60 amp electronic speed controller, 32 tooth pinion gear, it's 48 pitch. So we got our double stick tape, our tools. Hopefully this will be all we'll need, should be. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and start disassembling this thing, get the drive shaft on, get the motor swapped out. Uh, relocate some stuff so i'll show you guys that step too i'm gonna go ahead and remove six screws here we got one here two three four five and six so i'm gonna remove those i will get that way we'll have access to getting the center drive shaft replaced and also get the motor taken out and get to also there's a screw right here that will go ahead and remove that has is housing as far as the receiver and also the electronic speed controller all right i have all the six screws out so i'm gonna go ahead and remove the cover here Easy peasy. And also just gonna go ahead and remove the one screw that just holds this little cover on. So we're gonna put that to the side that we can get this motor comes right out. And then also we'll just take the drive shaft out. That'll be good. All right, drive shaft in, easy on that part of it. We'll take the receiver out, also the speed controller. So let me go ahead and get that. All right, stuff so out. the old components are taken out. We've relocated our receiver. We've installed the little motor mount, 32 tooth pinion gear. Got that installed, so you can kind of see the way it looks right now. We'll go ahead and install, put our motor in there. That's really easy, and there's no meshing needed because it already has the screws to the right setting for a 32 tooth pinion gear. It's in your manual too, so if you decide to go with a little bit larger pinion gear, it'll tell you what letters to put the screws on and you have the perfect mesh. Installed everything, even my cable management looks awesome. No, it doesn't, but that's okay. So we're gonna go ahead and put the six screws back in here. Right, we'll go ahead and run it on 2S, and then we'll run it on 3S, see how fast it goes. Stay on the ground. Everything set up, installed. So we'll go ahead and run this on a 2S LiPo 50C Discharge Venom Pack. So it's a 5,000 milliamp, and again, 2S LiPo. And we'll turn down our dual rate. It's already down quite a bit, but I'm gonna turn it down pretty a little bit more. So that way when we're going fast, this thing doesn't get out of control or if I move the wheel suddenly, could cause the car to flip over. We don't wanna hurt the body. Everything's installed, 2S LiPo run we're on zero miles per hour. So ready to go, we got our peak speed. So let's go ahead and get started. Let it rip. Step on it. All right, so we did 40 miles an hour on a 2S LiPo. Stock pinion gear is 48 pitch, 32 tooth pinion gear. So now we have our 3S LiPo pack in here. We got a, a 6,075C discharge LiPo battery. So I'm gonna go ahead and see how fast this thing goes. Okay, so it did 53 miles an hour before it or slid out of control. So. Let's see what it is. All right, it did 59. I'm good. I'm good right there. Like 59 miles an hour. Holy crap. It survived, we're good. <laughs> 